Well, Andre Neal joins us at the end of the first day, 303 for four Hampshire. It's been a day of toil for the Essex attack, Andre. Yeah, it's been a tough day. It's um, pretty cold and first day out we thought that we could do this slightly more. <laughs> we could actually play better than what we thought. Um, we passed with them ball well as a unit today, but those things happen and uh, hopefully we can come back tomorrow. The new ball's quite close and if we can bowl them out under 350, we would have done quite well coming back um, after they start. Never looking for excuses, but to be fair to the bowlers, it wasn't ideal conditions, was it? It's windy, wind, very windswept conditions, yeah. the wind blowing across the ground, cold and grey. It's not what fast bowlers or any bowlers <laughs> are looking for in these conditions. Yeah, it was a tough day, and also I think the outfield was slightly wet this morning. I think the ball went over quite often in the morning. Uh, could have made the ball start uh, wet, uh, could have made it look quite soft. Quite a full south with um, making the conditions easy to bet on. So it wasn't the best day and it wasn't the conditions that weren't um, the best. Uh, but like I said, we, we weren't on the button today and uh, I know we are fighting side and we'll come back better um, tomorrow. A couple of wickets for Quinny, that would be encouragement for him and you'd have been pleased at the nature of uh, how, he, how he took those two wickets. Yeah, I think he bowled nice. He, he bowled a, a good length and he just has to close his overs off slightly better. Um, the other guys weren't on it today. But like I said, tomorrow's uh, a new day, uh, a new ball close by. Uh, we can on the button fight better as a bowling unit. And I think we, uh, we'll still get them out on 350 and we're in the game. Yeah, they, they are a good batting side, we know that. Um, an uncontested toss, people are expecting wickets to fall regularly. Has the reduced seam on the ball, do you think, made a difference this year? Um, it could have been. Um, uh, like I said, I think it's more that it got slightly wet and got softer. I don't think. Uh, the seam could have played a part because it got so wet, uh, I don't think it affected it as much, but I think it just got softer really quickly and that also didn't help with the uh, uh, seam movement. I think when we got the second ball, we changed the first ball, it seemed like there was something a bit more in it, it was slightly harder, but then again, we went over the, the outfield again and the track looked slightly soft. Yeah. But uh, luckily, again, no, no excuses, we weren't on the button today, but um, we'll be back tomorrow stronger. A work in progress, especially not to pick too early in the season. Yeah, you? you don't win the championship on the first day of the, when the season starts. Yeah, just one word on Adam Wheaters' uh, injury update. He took a nasty ball from, uh, yeah. well, a nasty knock from Sam Cook, didn't he? Yeah, it looked quite innocuous. He, didn't, he took it, it didn't look as bad. Um, he's gone for x ray so we're waiting for uh, for news back from there. So we are going to know and credit to Dan Lawrence, he stepped in and did a good job. Didn't he? Hey, he did very well. I think he's, he's pretty talented, whatever he does, he does it quite well. So, yeah, he took the challenge on, he did, he did very nicely.